Hey guys, I'm here and I'm back to watch episode 12 of Code Geass. Let's see what's going to happen next, especially after the major win for the JLF and Zero's Black Knights because they taught Cornelia a very valuable lesson on not to underestimate the enemy. But more importantly, CC. My thing is, Lelouch was able to, when he touched CC and was able to see her pass, she then later told him in the cave that she has no memory of her past or anything. So as of right now, I'm getting from that is Lelouch knows more about her past than she does because she ain't got no memory of her past. He even knows her real name. Does she know her real name? Was that established last episode? I don't remember, but I'm saying that is a good thing and a positive. On the positive side is Lelouch has gotten to know her better, knows where she comes from, maybe even knows more about the Gios and what is it exactly, the history of that, where it came from. But also knowing how Lelouch is on his manipulation on people, which we've seen on how he manipulated Cornelia and Yuffie, because he knows Cornelia has a soft spot for Yuffie. He's really good at manipulating people. Is he going to use the information he has on Cece to manipulate her in future episodes? <sighs> I don't know, but I that's what I'm worried about because we're cheering for Lelouch, but at the end of the day, he's still a murderer. He still wants revenge on the Empire. He still was doing bad things, you know what I'm saying? It just happens to align with the JLF and he's, 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 and, um, you know, saving and helping people. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? So that's what I'm worried about. But let's go ahead and get started on episode 12. So are they trying to find a new approach on how to approach, uh, on intercepting zero? The dead list? Oh, they think Jeremiah is dead. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Who are they? Okay, they're part- obviously they're Japanese. So the JLF has been defeated? I know they destroyed other JLF bases. She's still thinking about that? Come on, girl. Get out of your head. You just tell him already that you like him because- come on. Honestly, we got way more important stuff to worry about. Oh, is that- Who's that? Oh. Yeah, see so you over here worried about him being with another girl. Just relax. Go ahead, just tell him how you feel. Who is she talking to? Who is she talking to? She's talking to something in her head. Is she talking to the Gios? Is the Gios alive? Is the Gios the collection of everybody in the past's consciousness? I don't know. Ooh, blowing the money, huh? So, Kyoto, is that- I'm not gonna lie, I was confused in the beginning of what they were talking about. But they can get more support and backing from other parts of other areas of the JLF. See, they want to know who he is. What the heck? What is she doing? Is she... She's becoming obsessed with the princess because the princess saved her? Oh. Okay, there's not that trust yet between them and Zero. They got some issues on how he became leader of them. I get it why they want to know who he is, but if they find out he's a Britannian, I don't know how they're going to feel. That would probably sow more distrust between them. And to find out he's a kid, that is that. And then Callan, he cannot let Callan know who he is. But they are going to find out eventually. How is this going to end? I'm, I don't even know. Dang, every time you hear this music, it's always something. Why does she need him to live so bad? Well, she can't use the gas herself. 
Yeah, they gotta dig through that whole slant slide, find survivors. Because there was a lot of people who died during that. You telling me they weren't even gonna do it without Suzaku <laughs> wanting to do it? Dang. The wave searcher. Oh! Yo, so the creator of Callan's robot was her, and they know who it was because they were able to track down what she did, how, like, what her robot uses. Did that make sense? So if they get a hold of Rakshata, the lady, they're gonna be able to find out who she gave that robot to. Who gave Callan, Callan's robot to. Oh, stop. Oh! How is he gonna get out of this? Uh, yeah, they all wanna know who he is. Is it gonna be CC? Oh my god. Oh! 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 Dang! How does he know this? Wow! Oh shoot! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! <gasps> huh? What? Eh? What? Oh my gosh! Guys, I may have to, I'm gonna have to rewatch this episode again. Oh wow. So he met this Japanese man when he was a little kid because he was taken in. Wow. Wow, and getting the support of a Japanese, the Japanese man such as Kirihara is going to make the Black Knights trust zero. Who? What? Wait a minute. my god okay guys uh wow so where do i even want to begin i had to go back and look at some stuff because i i was confused on how lelouch knew kirihara from kyoto but basically when he was a child suzaku's family because his uh, suzaku's father was the prime minister and the prime minister obviously has connections to the other big wigs across japan he the Prime Minister probably and Kirihara knows what happened to Lelouch's mother. That her, his mother was killed by the Britannian Empire, right? So he knew that Lelouch has this anger towards the Empire already. So it was so smart for Lelouch to put Cece in his place. Because he knew there, he just didn't want his identity to be revealed to the other eleven. Uh, about to call them eleven to be revealed to the Black Knights. Not yet, anyway. Especially because Callan's there. But revealing himself to Lord Kirihara because he knows him. He's met him before. 
Kiriata basically co-signed and validated like, hey, you guys can trust him. Even though you don't know him, what he looks like, you can trust this guy. That was so... I did not see that coming. Holy crap. I did not see that coming. And oh my god, I can't believe her father was killed. I cannot believe... I didn't see that coming. Because if you remember in the book... If you remember in the... um beginning of the episode they were talking about now that the JLF is gone they were saying that the 11s have their own delegates now I know her dad is not an 11 I can't think of her name right now what is her name what is her name oh my god the girl that likes Lelouch I I'm just at a blank right now because I'm just thinking about what's happened so far I can't believe her father passed away he died during the landslide that was caused by, that was all part of Lelouch's plan. So inadvertently Lelouch killed her father. If she finds out that Lelouch is zero. I don't even like, cause she, she blames zero. She blames zero for her father's death, of course. I don't even know. Oh my god. I totally did not see that coming. I'm shook right now. And also, the little girl, the granddaughter of Lord Kiriata, she was the one who sent Zero the MK Gurren, basically Callan's thing. Callan's, um, Callan's robot. So, she, they're big supporters already. She's a supporter of Zero and what he's doing. Now, the woman that they mentioned when Suzaku was talking with them on, um, I guess how the landslide started, she, they called it a wave surger, the wave surger, I guess that started the landslide, I think. They got that from a woman that they know. Now, if they go to her and try to, and, and ask her, who did you give that to? Who have you been talking to? She could possibly give them information. I have no clue, but... Guys, wow. Every episode is just... I feel so bad. Oh, man, that's terrible. What is Lelouch gonna... I mean, what can Lelouch do? Like, she already blames Zero for her father's death. And she likes Lelouch. She's gonna find out that... And then she's gonna feel like Lelouch lied to her. Obviously, he's lying. It's... I don't know, guys. I'm gonna leave it here. I'm going to leave it here. I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. Please like the video. Please leave a comment. Ask questions. I appreciate you guys who have been answering my questions. Because there's so many. This show is just very layered. Very. You, I really got to pay attention. Because I feel like sometimes I got to rewatch the episode because I'd be missing some stuff in the dialogue. But thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, but I'm going to leave it here. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.